الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى اله وصحبه وسلم ما بعد ان الذين كفروا سواء عليهم انذرتهم ام لم تنذرهم لا يؤمنون verily those who believe those who disbelieve it's the same if you call them or do not call them la yu'minun they will not believe those are the that's the case with the hypocrites and that's the case with those people whose hearts are hard and hardened towards iman that kufr and shirk and the hellfire is their abode that's the place they're going to reside in the hereafter But the believer has the traits they believe in the unseen. They, have ilm, they believe in ilm al-ghayb and they believe in the Quran with yaqeen and they pay they pl- they make salat. As the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, "Man taraka salat fakad kafar." Whoever leaves the prayer has disbelieved. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says about the believers, "Alif lam mim dhalika al-kitab la rayb fi hudin lil-muttaqin." That is the book, Alif Lam Mim, that is the book which is guidance for those who are God conscious. They fear Allah. Alladheena yu'minuna bil ghayb and they believe in the ghayb, they believe in the unseen. Wa yuqimuna salat and they establish the prayer. Wa mimma razaqnahum yunfiqun and from what we have provided for them? They spend, they spend their wealth. in the cause of Allah they spend it on their families they spend it on those people they're responsible for they help and assist the poor and the fuqara they do all the various ways of khair that's the characteristics of the believer and the characteristics of the disbeliever is that their hearts are hard they won't they won't accept haq they won't accept iman they won't accept uh the truth they won't accept belief in Allah and the creed of Ahlus Sunnah and the creed Uh, 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 kitab, based on Kitab al-Sunnah They don't accept that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says about them فِي قُلُوبِهِمْ مَرَضًا فَزَادَهُمْ اللَّهُمْ مَرَضًا وَلَهُمْ عَذَابٌ عَظِيمٌ وَلَهُمْ عَذَابٌ عَظِيمٌ بِمَا كَانُوا يَعْمَلُونَ And they will فِي قُلُوبِهِمْ مَرَضًا In their hearts is a sickness It's a disease في قلوبهم مرض ولهم عذاب عظيم and they're going to have a, a painful a, 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 a great torment ولهم عذاب عظيم بما كانوا يعملون for what they used to do the things they did in this life they're going to receive a painful torment for that the way they rejected the believers the way they rejected iman the way they fought ahli iman killed ahli iman persecuted Ahli Iman They're going to experience torment Adab Adab al-Azim You know, a painful torment Wa'iyadhan billah min dhalika And that's the opposite of Ahli Iman They're going to have Hum Humu muflihun Hudin linnas La'allahum Yuflihun Oh, la'allahum Ahli Iman will receive they'll they'll be the successful ones qad aflaha al mu'minun barely indeed the believer is successful and that's that's the state that's the the state of the believer that's the characteristic of the believer ahli iman ahli ikhlas ahli sunnah That's Ahli Iman. Those are the Muflihun. Those are the people who are successful in this life as well as the hereafter. If you have Iman, Iman Billah, wa Malaika, wa Kitab, wa Kutub, and in the messengers, alayhim after salat, salatu was salam, this is success. This is a sure success. And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil and protect us from kulli su wa makru and bless us to be of Ali man, those people who Allah is pleased with.
and who Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala blesses with success in this life as well as the hereafter. Wa sallallahu wa sallam.